Hello! Practical English, Episode 2. Coffee to take away. Всем здравствуйте! Сегодня практически английский эпизод второй. Кофе на вынос. Buying a coffee, telling the time. И сегодня мы будем изучать лексику, как покупать кофе. И учимся говорить время. So we start from the section wine vocabulary, telling the time. И мы начинаем с раздела номер один, словарный запас. Учимся называть время. Look at the clock. What time is it? And before you answer, let's go to the vocabulary bank, part two, page 157. Если вы не знаете, как ответить, и даже если знаете, идем на странице 157, изучаем словарный запас. Time, telling time, one. So, you may see several clocks and phrases. You should match one to another. Before you do it, let's talk about time. Итак, перед вами время. Нам нужно сопоставить время на часах с тем, как это звучит по-английски. Перед тем, как вы это сделаете, прослушайте информацию. You can ask for the time in two ways. What time is it or what's the time? Двумя способами можно спросить, который час. What time is it? What's the time? For times which are not multiple of five, multiplies of five, we use minutes. For instance, it's three minutes past six. When you can't be exact, use about what time do you get up? At about seven o'clock or seven a.m. It's American version. Итак, время можно спросить двумя способами. What time is it? И what's the time? Одинаково. Если вы знаете точное время, то говорите It's three minutes past six. Три минуты седьмого. Если вы не знаете, то говорите About seven o'clock. Примерно в семь. Please revise the material about saying the time. We'll practice it during our lesson. Повторите материал, материал о том, как называется время, какие предлоги используются. Напомню, past, до, to, после. То есть вот здесь вот, если стрелочка будет минутная, то это будет past. Если здесь будет стрелочка минутная, это будет to. На уроке мы попрактикуемся. Попрактикуемся мы в секции общения. Communication, what's the time? Uh, page 104 and 109. We'll do communication part as follows. Ask and answer questions with B, with A and B students, uh, and complete the times on the clocks. Then compare your clocks. Итак, мы будем работать следующим образом. Через раз у часов нет стрелок. Поэтому нужно спросить what's the time и ответить вот здесь. Разделимся и будем задавать друг другу вопросы. Please look through, be ready with the answers. Просмотрите и будьте готовы ответить. And now we start practical English episode 2. Do you remember who are they and where are they? Let's listen. And what happens when Rob and Jerry meet? What do they decide to do? 3.27 Um, Jennifer? Rob? Yes. Hello. Nice to meet you, Jennifer. Uh, call me Jenny. Good to meet you too. Welcome to London. Am I late? Um, just a little. What time is it? 9.15. I'm really sorry. The traffic is terrible today. 
No problem. How are you? How's the hotel? The hotel's very nice, but breakfast isn't great. I'd like a good cup of coffee. Not hotel coffee, real coffee. Okay, let's get a coffee. Do I have time? I have a meeting at 9.30. With Daniel? Yes. Don't worry. We have lots of time. The office is very near. So, Jenny, where do you live in New York? Okay, watch or listen it again. Answer the questions why. Why is Rob late? Why doesn't Jenny like the hotel breakfast? Why is Jenny busy after 10.30? Why does Rob say don't worry? Итак, послушайте еще раз, если нужно, и ответьте на вопросы почему. Вот эти вопросы здесь. Be ready with the answers. If you need, you may write uh, the answers into your copy box. Будьте готовы с ответами. Если нужно, можете записать их себе в тетрадь. Buying a coffee. Look at the coffee shop menu. Do you know what all these things are? Посмотрите на меню в кофейне. Все ли вам тут известно и знакомо? Espresso. Single or double. Americano. Regular or large. Latte. Regular or large. Cappuccino. Regular or large. Tea. Brownie. Croissant. Now let's listen. Rob and Jenny uh, are buying coffee and answer the questions. 3.28 Can I help you? What would you like, Jenny? An espresso, please. Single or double? Double. Can I have a latte, please? Regular or large? Large. To have here or take away? To take away. Anything else? No, thanks. A brownie for me, please. And a croissant? Okay. How much is that? That's 12.45, please. Sorry, how much? 12.45. Thank you. And your change. Thanks. Okay, and now we answer the questions. What kinds of coffee do Jenny and Rob have? What do they have to eat? How much is it? Is it? You may listen again and complete you hear phrases. Послушайте еще раз и заполните фразы, которые вы слышите. And now repeat you say phrases. Copy the rhythm. Three point twenty nine. Can I help you? What would you like, Jenny? An espresso, please. Single or double? Double. Can I have a latte, please? Regular or large? Large. To have here or take away? To take away. Anything else? No, thanks. A brownie for me, please. And a croissant. Okay. How much is that? That's 12.45, please. Sorry, how much? 12.45. Thank you. And your change. Thanks. During our lesson, we'll do role play the conversation in groups of three and change the roles. На уроке мы разыграем по ролям диалог продавец кофе Jenny and and Rob. 
Barista is a person who works in a coffee shop, probably, you know, because in Russian we have the same word. Okay, this is for our lesson, and we have some more audio files to listen. Uh, listen and answer the questions, please. Three point thirty. Here we are. This is the office, and this is Karen. Hello, Karen. Karen, this is Jennifer Zielinski from the New York office. Hello, Jennifer. Nice to meet you. Karen is our administrator. We all depend on her. <laughs> Don't listen to Rob. But it's true. Is this your first time in the UK, Jennifer? Yes, it is. But it isn't my first time in Europe. I have family in Poland. Really? And where do you live in New York? In Manhattan. Do you know New York? Yes. My sister lives in Brooklyn. Oh, I have family in Brooklyn too. Where does your sister live? Jennifer. Daniel. How nice to meet you. At last. Would you like something to drink? Tea, coffee. Water? Oh no, I'm fine, thanks. Great. Oh, Karen, what time is my next meeting? At twelve o'clock. That's good. We have time. Okay, come into my office, Jennifer. Thank you. Talk to you later, Rob. Yeah, sure. Okay, now look at the social English phrases. Who says them? Rob, Karen, or Daniel? Social English. And then uh, watch or listen and repeat the phrases. 3.31 1. Here we are. 2. Is this your first time in the UK? 3. Would you like something to drink? Four. Talk to you later. Okay, and the last one, complete conversation from A to D with social English phrases. А теперь эти фразы нужно вставить сюда, вот там, где квадратики. Okay, and uh, after this lesson, you should, uh, you should be able uh, to tell the time, to order food or drink in a cafe, and meet and introduce people. We'll practice it during our lesson. That's it for now. Thank you. Bye-bye.